I would like to begin by thanking everyone for being here today and for giving me and my family their condolences. It has been very comforting to share our grief with all those that knew my mental health. We're here today because we all share memories with my mental health and now she's no longer with us. My mental health was great and she had a childlike enthusiasm that came out with everyone. She loved making everyone happy. I remember her laughter whenever she went on her camping trip with her link group. She was happy to share a tent with her friend Megan and was also happy to share Sayla to prepare the food for everyone else. She was also so forgetful that she forgot to pack almost half her things, but nevertheless, she surprised everyone with her improvisation. She also loves trying new things out. Whenever she went to the lake with her group of friends, she put on a life jacket and jumped in the water, even though she didn't know how to swim. My mental health could be annoying and pity at times too. She was very upset whenever she didn't get the room she wanted at Johnson Hall, even though she ended up rooming with her friend Anna anyway. And let's not forget how much of a procrastinator she was. She always said she worked un better under pressure. This was true, but she was also killing herself in the process. The change of splitting the semester in half messed with everyone, but it specially served in giving her her final blow. The stress of how fast classes went and how deadlines seemed to appear out of nowhere was too much. She was also currently looking super tired and didn't want to get up in the mornings anymore. Unfortunately, she couldn't take it and she was only able to finish the first seven weeks. But let's not take her experiences in life in vain. She touched the hearts of everyone here and for that, let's celebrate her life and learn from her mistakes. My mental health would surely want y'all to do so.